Good morning, I'm Jen Zielinski with your AM update for Friday, June 5th. Well, yesterday proved to be deadly on BC highways after there were three fatalities. In our region, a man was killed after his vehicle collided head-on with a semi-truck south of Peachland along Highway 97. His female passenger was taken to hospital with serious injuries. A witness on the scene tells Castanet a white Toyota allegedly tried to pass another vehicle and hit the semi head-on. Then along Highway 1, a 63-year-old woman died when her vehicle crashed into a semi near Boston Bar. In Oliver, a teenage girl was struck by a motorhome. The vehicle tried to avoid the pedestrian but was unsuccessful. She was transported to hospital and later died from her injuries. Issues continue on our roads today as the Coquihalla was closed for a portion of the morning after a semi-truck caught fire south of Merritt near Larson Hill. Southeast Major Crimes continues to investigate today after a man was found dead at the Golden Sands Resort in Penticton. A complaint of shots fired was reported around 3 a.m. Thursday. Police believe that this is an isolated incident. Our country's labour force received a boost in jobs last month. Statistics Canada reported this morning of a surge in the private sector. However, the national unemployment rate in May remained locked at 6.8% for the fourth straight month. And after three days of rain, the Okanagan forecast is for sunny skies and temperatures reaching nearly 30 degrees. But that also means we could be in for an influx in mosquitoes. The regional district warns residents to remove any standing water that could provide a breeding ground for the pests. For this and more, continue to watch castanet.net.